Keith gets the crap into everything, baby. Shout out to PG Keith, man. You guys need <laughs> graphics and stuff like that done. You better don't call Tyrone. Call Keith, baby. We out, man. <laughs> I love you guys. All right, boy. <laughs> All right, man. Off to the next uh, action here in Winter's Quarters. Folks, again, this is just a five-character uh, five character spectacular. Puppe this time coming in. Remember, Puppe actually getting here by beating Sam Sora. Mm -hmm. A lot of people did not have that one pegged. And then Senji, he's been doing work himself. Uh, first time seeing him compete on stream, so that's going to be nice. Actually, another uh, Pac-Man main. Yeah. Going to be getting some shine right now. But it looks like he's going to go ahead and whip out the tomb ring. I expect, it, I expect Senji to just play all the frustrating projectile characters. I see that lineup. I see Mega Man in there. It's like Mewtwo, Greninja. All right, so he's going to be doing some work for show. Yeah, characters that get some uh, some mileage off the dash attack too, man, which is actually really great to see. Greninja's received some pretty uh, some pretty noticeable buffs, some pretty noticeable changes too here. This installment in Smash right here. But Charizard right here taking a page out of the Smash 4 book, using Flamethrower at the ledge here to try to stop Senji in his tracks. Smart stuff right there. Just kind of pulled the trigger just slightly early. Uh-oh. Okay, smart. I was really hoping that last swing would knock Charizard into the stage. I could have been a, a missed stage tech. Oh, my good ah. seismic toss, though. All right, we'll take it. Puppe making the first statement. Okay, wow. These low percent combos from Squirtle always just intrigue me so. And then you can just switch into the Ivysaur and just continue to attack on the damage, man. PT in the place to be. Oh, really? Yeah, this is really just a know, Pokemon battle, Bill. This is one of this might be Puppe's best character, PT. And one of his, certainly one of his strongest. So for this to be his lead is absolutely just terrifying. He's just kind of ripping through Sinji's uh, fifth and fourth areas with no issue at all. As Mewtwo makes his appearance, two stock different. You better, get, you better get Mewtwo out of here. He don't want no smoke with Ivysaur, all right? All right, this ain't Pokemon the first movie. Oh, wait, I spoke too soon. My bad, y'all. Anyway, though, <laughs> let's go ahead and get right into this next one right here. So, Palutena obviously onto the main stage. And don't get it twisted, though. Like, all jokes aside, I do think Mewtwo is still pretty good. Yeah. Um, even in, in this, you know, patch, I know, like, he's received a couple changes in, in the new one that we're not playing on. But I do think Mewtwo's good. You just, uh, you just can't stay back in the cut anymore. You have to approach a little bit more, which is okay. I mean, that's what we were used to seeing with Mewtwo literally up until Smash 4. Like, they would do things like short hop in there and tech chases and just like a bunch of weird stuff like that. But Just wait till 3.0. Yes, right. <laughs> see me, it was, at first it was see me in Ultimate, now it was see me in 3.0. There you go. That's what Mewtwo will truly have his due. Right now, just trying to do his best over a very game puppy. Not looking to let this lead slip away. Nope. Damn. Oh, my. Oh my goodness, explosive flame indeed. Okay, cooking up Mewtwo here. Can't quite catch him with the down tip, but that back throw is going to do some sizable damage. He's off stage. What are we about to turn it into? Oh yeah, oh wait. I thought that was it. Yeah, that would have been sick if he was able to connect that. Get that out of here, boy. Wow. Okay, using the Shadow Balls. Okay, smart stuff. You know, they, I like uh, I like the Uncharged Shadow Balls as well as the Charged Up ones. I think Charged all the way, they do like 31, but Uncharged is cool, too, because you can toss one, and then since they go uh, a sizable distance, you can run along with it and try to find an opening for a grab. But regardless, we'll never see that here in this match because Mewtwo is out of the picture. But we're switching over to another uh, decently strong character, man, depending on who you ask. Mega Man. This version of Mega Man is still very strong, too. Come here. Back throw. Okay, hits him with the yeet. Oh, oh wow. Wow, wow, wow. The Z drop right into the back. That was actually some, uh, some pretty tricky stuff. That it was. Right. Oh, wow, this Bowser Jr. is moving. Right. Put that tongue away, boy. That's right. What type of party do you think this is? Man. Okay. Nice. Oh, my. Oh, get that. Oh, wait, wait a minute. Does that move have armor on it? I didn't know that. See, I, I think uh, Bowser Jr., very highly slept on character. You know, obviously, people have kind of uh, unanimously, unanimously decided that this character is the worst in the game. And I'm like, I just don't know if I believe it. I just, I just don't. Eh, I just don't, man. It just comes down to preference, just, man. Yeah, it just comes down to preference and who's piloting the character. Like, it's it, this game is too hard to just have a decisive worst in the game. But obviously, Bowser Jr. is kind of down there in the basement with a couple characters. Not looking too bad or doing too bad of a job right now. Sticking and flicking. Really, just putting the screws too singy. Wait a minute. Oh, okay. Gets the red stuff. Oh, wow. I'll try to hit him with the hard knuckle. Come here. Oh, yeah. We knew that back there was coming, boy. You better Ooh, switch it up. Be dead. Yeah, okay. So, Senji down to his final character. That is the Pac-Man. 
And if this is ever a chance for him to make a comeback, it'll be off the heels of this. Senji, let's see. But speaking of heels, there's that back air. Oh, that's, oh yeah, he immediately tossed that key out. I'm not wasting no time. I don't got time for setups, all right? Not at all. You knew what it was from the jump. Okay, Apple gets, oh, gets rid of the Koopa bot. Okay. All right, all right. Two all characters right, go through. You see that wolf in the pocket of, of Puppet, the last character to anchor because that is his main. Between that and PT, I mean, when you lead with, leading and closing with your two strongest characters, you're going to have a pretty good time. Oh, ay yeah, yeah. Okay, get get fancy on him if you can, man. Like I, I I've always felt like Pac-Man has some cool low percent stuff, even without like a fancy setup. Sure. Like this character can still kind of string you along with some of those aerials. Oh my Ooh. lord, this coverage from Puppe is nasty, bro. Any decision Sinji tries to make, Puppe is just there with the answer. Uh huh. And that blade does damage. Oh, oh okay. Phil, did you see that? <laughs> no, I did you see I that? I love the attempt. I love the attempt. He is swagging out right now. Okay, once more another. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You saw some. Yeah, get that out of here. All right. Gets the fire hydrant back in there. Okay, has the bell. Oh, made a minute. Okay, four there at the bell, too, man. Can we talk about just staring danger in the face? Man, it's crazy. Okay. Watch how you get up off that ledge, though. Oh. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's yeah, it. See ya. Do it. Convincing two stock. From Puppe, hold it down for MDVA. Uh, I wonder how many uh, MD, MVDA uh, representatives are still in this. MDVA, uh, god dang, say that five times fast. MDVA representatives are still in this. Singles and in squad strike. Because I feel like of all the regions that I've been to, when I come to like Glitch, when I come to Pound It, you guys do a pretty solid sized job at like trying to hold off some of the out of region contenders, you know? Not too, I mean, we do a pretty decent job. Well, when we and, getting uh, filled back on the sticks, brother. Huh? Yeah, I saw those. That's cool. Thanks, <laughs> thanks Vince. Did you hook that up yourself, Vince? Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, dang. All right, man. Next game right here. So, Sinji, obviously going to run the Pac-Man again. That is, uh, you know, his calling. So, we got uh, Young Link, Fox, Inkling, and King K. Rule, man. King K. Rule, a.k.a. the scrub on line killer. Let's see if you can scrub it up right here, man, in this game. We got some cleaning up to do. Man, and right. shout out to you guys at home, man, just hanging out with us in the, in the Twitch chat. You know what I'm saying? Watching at the crib. You guys could have been doing literally anything else, and I know what you guys could have been doing because I know the date, but you're deciding to hang out with us and watch some Smash ultimate action at its highest faction right here, man. Yeah, it's always always good to have the homies come through, no doubt about that. So. It's always a treat when players meet, baby. There it is. All right. Well, game number two with Pope taking it with a two-stock, a high percent, but a two-stock nonetheless. It really set the tone early with this Pokemon trainer, which Sinji just did not have much of an answer for. Oh, a dash attack. You ever see a dash attack at the ledge and was like, is that supposed to be a runoff aerial? I feel like that's what that was supposed to be, especially when it's Ivysaur. Like runoff, uh, runoff up air, runoff forward air. Whatever the case may be, that should be an up air immediate. Oh, it goes for back air. Okay. So after ground, fam, what the heck? All right, Sinji. Sinji he out here getting that. dingy. Uh, yeah, <laughs> straight up, man. I mean, you got to go ahead and try and take this to a game number three. You got to make those big plays early. And that's exactly what Sinji's doing. Oh, oh all right. All right. Man. Damn. <laughs> All right, Phil. What was that? That's, what was that? Bro? Unfortunate. Yeah, that was definitely unfortunate. All right. Get up Sinji, off that platform. Sinji Fox? I didn't know you even had a Fox. You're about to learn today. All right. All right, all right, all right, indeed. Up tilt. Every, every light skinned brother got a Fox. They got Larry, you got Light. Why the hell not Sinji? Okay, first of all. Where's the lie, though? Okay, first of all. So, let's rewind real quick. All right, man. Larry, Larry. Yeah. Larry Larry is mahogany. <laughs> he's not light skin. What the hell is he, Maple? Yeah, man. It's not. Nice. He's not light skin. If he's light skin, I'm light skin. Man, this is the light. It's just it's the light. I'm Keith Caramel. Okay. Hey, man. Rock the Snickers. All right, you're right, man. I'm not myself. All right. I'm not myself right now, man. He's allergy medicine. They're calling the shots. All right. Ooh. Oh my goodness! Ah. I, the medicine ain't the only thing calling the shots. Go here in this match right now, man. Puppe looking to close out this game. This fox wants to get it up out of here, man. So we can switch it over to the ink. 
Inkling. I'm actually really interested to see Sinji's Inkling. You know, we've seen a different combination of characters in the last game, and look no further. Inkling is here, baby. Let's see what we get here, man. Started out with the Splat Bomb, has the clip fully loaded. Let's see if he's about to empty it. As we know, man, you get the ink on the opponent. Obviously, it multiplies the damage here ever so slightly. Yeah, Sinji really kind of switched this lineup I mean, between the Fox and the Inkling. I've been trying to make, make some plays right now, but Pup A, I mean, this. Lucina as potent as ever. All oh. right. Oh, yep. good stuff right there, man. There's no platforms here, too, man. So that's one thing both these characters are going to have to take into consideration. Well, never mind. They back. Oof. All right, Sinji. He's got to kind of pick it up. He is getting sliced and diced. And I love the fact that Puppe just does not shy away. Just putting on all that aggression. And really seeing the difference. Okay. Smart patience. Love the shield pressure there. But Sinji going to weave in and out and able to get us up smash, secure that stock. So only right. trailing 70% too insurmountable. But this Palu from Puppe has proven to be lethal. That's right, man. She's doing a little bit better at just kind of uh, the manageability of uh, his stocks, obviously. You know, it's not enough, obviously, to be winning. You have to make sure that, you know, you have enough characters still in your arsenal, man, so you can try to keep yourself in the game. Because the great thing about Puffa, and especially playing against a character like Palutena, is that this character just whittle away at you. I mean, it just chips and chips and chips. You see right here, man, there's another Nair. Explosive Flame, like, this character is just kind of everywhere at once. Oh. Physically longer, and then, of course, it has Explosive Flame and Auto Reticle right there, too, to kind of pinpoint you and stop you in your track. Ooh. Love the way she's just able to kind of almost trap you, in a sense. Put out. All kinds of pressure. And Sinji just trying to find a way to get back safely. But Pope with the yeet to secure that stock. And it is getting troublesome. And yes, I didn't want to say anything earlier, folks. But Nate, make no bones about it. That is King K, PB and J coming to the screen right now All right. to try and jam it and get Sinji a game. Jam it the heck. All right, man. The wise words of PB and J right there, man. He says the king, baby. Oh, Ooh. yes. OK. That's actually one of uh, PBNJ's dance moves. Man, you already know. I've seen him do that on the dance floor, man. See right there. Oh, I know that move, I've too. I've seen him do that, too. Rebuffed. Yeah, that. <laughs> <laughs> just not that empty, am I? You do. Yeah, I'm right now. <laughs> We're just having fun right now. I don't know if it's all funny games for Sinji, though, man. He's definitely trying to win this one, but he'll settle for that botch recovery that Puppe put out. Yeah. And give himself an opportunity. Oof. Okay. Gets the Nair, he's backing off. He said, yeah, man, I understand. You're Falco, I'm King K. Rule. You don't really have the means to kill me anytime soon. We're, we're, in this, we're in this for the long run. He got that stomach cracked up, though. Not really good. Tosses the crown, come here. Ooh, oh, oh, I love that attempt. I do. That was gorgeous. Ooh, okay, but that big body is going to keep him good. What a trap, though, right there. I'm going to force out that air dodge. I have enough time to recover. And the back air is waiting. So, Sinji, it all comes down to this. The pack can ill afford to be whacked. Okay. Oh, wow. Empties, empties out the clip on him. Man, he right just, ate those. He just ate those, man. Come on now. Are you awake? Okay, wait a minute. Chasing him down here. Getting kind of relentless. That's the great thing about Falco. So, you can chase you down, man. Just consistently put on crazy, crazy percent. Even if, and the great thing too about Puppet, that even if he doesn't get the stock taken, the fact that he's playing Falco so well and he's just constantly chiseling here at Sinji. That wolf is still in his pocket. You know what I'm saying? Oh, okay. Yeah, see ya. Wow. That's... Oh, wait, no, not see ya. Yeah, I was going to say, what I mean, at, that per, at that percent, I would have been very surprised to see it go down like that. But Pup A, I mean, look, he opened things up with a two stock. It looks like he's trying to close with one as well. Oh, my goodness. Okay, does he get the fruit online? He does not. He's setting up shot once more here, man, but. Things are just not looking good for Sinji, man. 89%. And then the reflector, too, is the biggest deterrent here in this matchup. Like, what the heck? Well, in fact, he ran up, too, thinking that maybe he'd get fortunate. If he had predicted that grab, he actually probably could have ended things. Oh, that was certainly untackable. You saw them red sparks everywhere. Mm -hmm. All right, Sinji. Now's your chance. Grab. Oh, that's right. He can't. That's not it. That's not it. Oh, catches it before the reflector. Uh -oh. oh, hold up. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Ooh, oh. baby. The combination station is open. All aboard. Oh, no, he did not. Oh, he is getting, okay, smart stuff, man. Air dodges away, fakes him out, snaps the ledge too, but then eats oh, the boot. Man, that's tough, man. He did an excellent job. Valiant fight from Sinji, but just could not overcome the deficit he found himself in early.